Hello and welcome back to Buzz Banter. I'm Mo. And I'm Sam. And apparently we've been camping out here. Apparently. Uh, so yeah, we've got yet another video game review for you guys. This one less interesting than the previous. Well, yeah, because Bioshock Infinite was actually pretty awesome. It was amazing. But that aside, we need to talk about another game that came out. And this is, well, every platform has its sort of Hallmark games that you buy the system for, and every time there's a new release for that, you have to pay attention to it. So because Halo 4 we already did, we're doing Gears of War. Yep, you have Gears of War Judgment, a prequel, because everyone loves prequels, because they're fantastic and they add so much to the story and characters. This could have yeah. just been a book. Actually, I'm pretty sure it probably was a book. This also could have just been a book. You follow Baird and a younger Coltrane and a before he became. Yeah, they, all right. This is why I say Baird and a younger Coltrane. Coltrane, over the course of the three games, he got louder and a little more obnoxious. And in the third game, he had like these golden moments where he would just kind of stop and remember who he used to be. He had a couple of golden moments. Uh, yeah, he. It, it, it was nice, uh, but then. In Gears of War Judgment, when you see him after he's, like, recently joined the COG and he's still a young man, he doesn't have that cocky demeanor about him. He's well, it's very... it's been, like, 30 days. He is very... Uh, and I, I think you can say that about the game in general. It, 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 is a sol it is a solid game on its own. It's a solid Gears of War game. Yes. Uh, but we haven't talked about the biggest controversy, which is they took out Horde Mode. They took out Horde Mode and added in Survival Mode, which is essentially the same thing. Horde Mode was the big calling card of Gears of War. It wasn't just that it was a big calling card of Gears of War. After they did it, every game in installed yeah, a it was, Horde it Mode. Yeah, it was the reason to have Gears of War. Like, it was Gears yeah. of War's reason, it was Gears of War's claim to fame. It is a prequel. You see uh, the younger bear, back when he was a lieutenant, leading Kiel Squad, and, uh... Paddock, who's the angry Russian guy with the burn scars, because every Russian character has to have scars. And be uh, a stereotype. Uh, it, and as stereotypical as he is, he is kind of fun. This is a very meh game. Uh, it is obviously a direct-to-DVD a sequel yeah, it of is, yeah. the Gears of War game. They kind of dropped the ball on both fronts, both in the single player and the multiplayer. This is the thing that bothered me more than anything else. Gears of War is well known for its grand sequences that, oh look, there's a Brumach, we're gonna have to kill it. Or, hey, why don't we ride that Brumach? There's over? boss levels. It, exactly. You have bosses, you have these large th things that happen. You have these grand sequences in the previous games that are completely absent in this game. It's not that they're reduced, it's that they simply do not exist. And it bothers me. The previous three games have been solidly fun, and this one was a massive letdown. Uh, so but it's still not a ter. It's not the worst. It's game. not a terrible game. It's Tech. just that it's just that compared to its predecessors, it's not nearly. It's as good. lackluster. It is. It, it it very much is. Unfo it, it is unfortunate, but hey, it's enjoyable. It, it's enjoyable enough that it's worth picking up once the price comes down. That's yeah. what I will say. It, it's not something to be avoided, but neither is something that you need to get. It's very meh. 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 And on that meh, we bid you adieu. Farewell from your helpful little friends at Buzz Banter. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow us on our parent website of boxofficebuzz.com. And until next we meet, I'm Mo. I'm Sam. Bye-bye. We'll see you when we see you.